The chisel tip. Give the man credit. He has a talent for destroying things. Remember that, Head. Never leaves my mind. Those were the guys we saw with Balder. His nephews? Aye. Magni and Modi. The sons of Thor. Mother always said the Aesir were the worst of gods. And Thor was the worst of the Aesir. Guess he's a terrible father, too. They are no longer children. They have no excuse. Will Sindri be okay? They'll never even see him. Ah, the great dining hall. Envy of all Midgard. Funny. I remember there being a massive candelabrum. Really livened up the place. There. Ah, yes. Roma! You just can't help but break things, can you? The Jarl's throne was just on the other side of that wall of ice.
something ahead. See, lad? He's fine. Thought it best to vanish when Thor's idiot sons showed up. Let's get started then. shouldn't let my brother lay his hands on it again, but if he does, tell him to temper his steel longer. He's warping the bit work. Master Atreus? How may I serve? Something else for you, then? You don't have to run off on my account. Huh. Would you focus on your damn job again? You quit that shit. I mean it! He went to war with Uncle and walked away. Maybe. Uncle had three straight years. As long as father believes him, so do we. So you will stop talking, focus, <gasps> and help me find him. Who can't disappoint father? Oh, smack your boy. No, we cannot disappoint father. Now keep looking. <gasps> Hurry, brother. We may get a piece of the chisel and be gone before they even notice. Uh oh. Yeah. Boy. Surrender. The old father demands it. No. Good. This fight is mine, boy. Go! And where do you think you're going? Oh no, brother! The little freak's got a bow! What are we gonna do? Small <laughs> one's yours, brother! Don't tell me what to do! A weak showing, brother. I can't remember the last time. Oh, no blind! Oh, there, draw there, bleed there. I can't see. Stay behind me, boy. Why do you hunt us? What does Odin want? Don't oh, know. Don't care. Come here, half. You're done holding Daddy's hand. Shut up! Don't call me that! Can't believe you've lasted this long. Those skinny little arms can barely lift the gun. I said shut up! Calm yourself, boy. Looks like they need another lesson. You're more than happy to teach, brother. Oh, take the little thing. Weak and pathetic. Stop! Unbelievable. You mean to oppose the might of Asgard? You've got some father, kid. But I'll put you back for you. Don't leave that. I'm 
So you look like her. Don't talk about my mother! Don't talk about my mommy! <laughs> Don't listen to him, lad! He's trying to rile you up! Eat it! Yeah. Sons of four are welcome to try! Head! Sorry! Overstepped, yeah? yeah. We're coming for you! We're From coming behind. for you! Heads up, assholes! Nobby! Oh. What's the matter? Yeah. There's a little run for his mom! Stop it! Boy! Stay focused! Yeah! I'm on the Didn't want me to see Too ugly to let you suck on it. Shut up, you bastard! Blood. The boy's sick, he needs flair. No! Steady. I'll be all right. There you go, lad. <clears throat> I'm fine, see? We should keep an eye on him. Enough. Should do. With that, we can carve the travel room to Jotunheim. Get you where you need to go. 
Oh, incidentally, all those magically sealed doors we've seen can now be unlocked. Like that one round the corner. You can get through that door there now that you've got the chisel. You killed Maggie. That he did. He was a god. But you killed him. Minor Aesir, perhaps. But I... And his father is Thor. Not minor. Not minor at all, him. This will not go over well in Asgard. I defended us. Nothing more. I fear no judgment. Judgment, no. But if vengeance is any concern... Since when can you kill a god? <coughs> hey, Sindri. Wait, we were here before. But which way back? Oh. The travelers. Oh, disgusting. Mm, smelly, covered in God knows how many little beasties, but gorgeous armor. Let's see if I can't make something more sanitary. Yes? Just make sure you watch each other's backs in the storeroom. Wouldn't want to lose my loyal customers. I don't think the lad's doing too well. I'm fine. <coughs> Nothing to worry about. If so, then keep up. Yes. Hey, I just realized. Magni didn't come back to life. That is interesting. It's known the Aesir find their own way to Valhalla. No Valkyrie escort, no processing at the gates of Helheim. That may be significant. Atreus, to me! I'm coming, I'm coming! Look, we're back near the giant's hand. What? What is this place? Fishermen would bring the day's catch into this port and use that contraption to send some of it directly to the Jarl's main kitchen. And the rest were sorted and sold. There is an exit under the thumb. Find a way across. It's moving. <coughs> How do we reach it? There is an opening. I can get it. There's a path to the exit on the other side. There's a rope up here. <coughs> Back under his palm. We're almost there. Everything we just did. Climbed around a dead giant. Rode a giant falling hammer. Fought some bad gods. What do you think Mother would say? Bet you have come a long way. Thanks. What now then? Maybe Freya ought to have a look at the boy. No. I feel better now. I just needed to catch my breath. Where do we go next? Well, now that we've got the giant's chisel, we need to learn the travel rune to Jotunheim. 
so we can carve it into that special gateway atop the peak, an open realm travel to the land of the giants. You don't know it? Alas, no. But the serpent did mention that the giants had entrusted that secret to Tyr. Isn't Tyr dead? Aye, but his hidden vault is very much in reach. The doors are beneath his temple, submerged in the lake for generations until our snake friend shifted his weight. There we shall find the fabled Black Rune of Jotunheim. We could also explore some more. We got that chisel now, and that vault isn't going anywhere. Seems a shame to waste the boat. We shall see, boy. Lemire, you were in the middle of a story before. What were you saying about the long war? Enough was enough. And at last, Odin's most brilliant advisor became determined to find a more enlightened path. He set about to broker a peace between the gods. It took some convincing, but ultimately Odin was persuaded to marry his deadliest enemy, a certain Vanir goddess, legendary not only for her fertile beauty, but her genius at the very Vanir magic that Odin had long aspired to master. Freya married Odin? What was in it for her? It was a sacrifice to protect her people, a selfless act of love. Truly, she deserves better than she got, but of course there's more to that story. Ooh, Tyr's vault is behind that magical lock. Brother, the chisel. We're setting foot in Tyr's vault. Another one of these. It's Tyr, but the middle panel is missing. Wait, I thought Tyr was a god, not a giant. Ah, but he was loved by everyone, including the giants. Other than me, he was the only one they gifted with their special sight. Hey, I wonder if the giants left a triptych about me somewhere, too. Go ahead. Actually, come look. Let me show you how to read this. That is not necessary. You've taught me so much. Let me teach you something. Atreus. Come on. You already speak it. Learning to read won't be that hard. I know how to read, boy. Just not this tongue. You're halfway there already, then. Okay. So the runes represent a lot of different things. Some gods, some animals. Wait. Some... Oh, am I going too fast? Sorry. Not I'll... that. Do you smell something? Yeah, I do. Smells like rain. <laughs> Everyone's gonna think I only got it, cause Magni's gone! It'll be a joke! But if I kill you, no one's gonna laugh at me! Oh, are you dumb? That your father's doing? Or did you get it from your mum? She's stupid and ugly. That's true, but I'm gonna get to know you really well. You're gonna be my new brother, right after I finish killing your father! Oh! Stop it! <laughs> Oops, I think I broke him. <laughs> No! 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 The 
Ça, je le vois Brother, the boy. Atreus. You have to get into Freya quickly. There's no other way. Take the boat. Freya's isn't far. Odin's eye is on you, brother, especially now that you've taken to killing his kin. Freya's forest is a blind spot for him. This is our smartest move, and if anyone can heal him, it's her. What is happening to him? I've seen it in mortals that some conflict of the mind expresses itself as an ailment of the body. Never in a god, but a god believing himself mortal. I can only imagine. We're almost there. Somebody just called the serpent. Yes. Burns harder. He is shaking. It's serious. We must hurry. Freya! Open the door! We need your help! Woman, do you hear me? It is urgent! I'm still a god. Go away. The boy has fallen ill. Freya! He's ill. Inside. This is no ordinary illness. The boy's true nature, your true nature, fights within him. I did this to him. Will you help me? There is a rare ingredient found only in Helheim. The keeper that protects the Bridge of the Damned. I need its heart. Mm -hmm. Hell. The Realm of the Dead. Do you know it? Not this one. It is a land of unyielding gold. Fires cannot burn there, and no magic in all the Nine Realms can create a blaze. As for the dead, your Frost Axe will be useless. You'll need to find something else. Then I must return home. D. 
speak of a past I swore would stay buried. Who you were before doesn't matter. This boy is not your past, he is your son. And he needs his father. This rune opens the bridge to Helheim. When you are there, do not under any circumstances cross the Bridge of the Damned. There is no road back. Understand? Mm. Uh. Boy. Hey, Malay. You must hurry. Through my garden, there's a path leading to my boat. Take it. Return home. Dig up your past. Do whatever you need to do. Just bring me back the Bridgekeeper's heart, and your son may survive. Last we spoke, I was... No. You were right to distrust the word of a god. No need to explain. Not to me, not for that. I will keep him safe. That's a mother's promise. Helheim of all places. You all right, brother? I will do what I must. Leave me be. Right side, brother! 
There's nowhere you can hide, Spartan. Put as much distance between you and the truth as you want. It changes nothing. Pretend to be everything you are not. Teacher. Husband. Father. But there is one unavoidable truth you will never escape. <laughs> You cannot change. You will always be a monster. I know. But I am your monster no longer. Right, brother. Let's see what those blades can do. Yeah! <laughs> 
those blades will serve quite well in Helheim. Now, I believe I see a door to the realm between realms over there, in your own front yard, no less. Take the shortcut back to the realm travel temple, then on to Helheim, yeah? Well, I'm pretty sure you weren't talking to me back there. Anything you'd like to get off your chest, brother? I can assure you I'm unsurpassed in keeping confidences. Well, you know where to find me. And for the record, I'd already guessed you were Greek. Athena, dead giveaway. foreign magic. Sweet Nana's nethers. What are those? I've never seen the like. That's gotta be a family heirloom. No. Nor will it ever be. Son, my brother and me created me all near for the big idiot. I know from quality. And them, them special. Hey, where's the little turd? He has fallen ill. No. What happened? Aesir? No. The fault is mine. And my responsibility to make it right. Hmm. Well... We all gotta take responsibility sometime. Huh? Say, what can I do to help him? I can do things. And what I should tag along? No. Your work here is enough. All right. So where are you off to in such a hurry? The realm of the dead. Helheim? Shit, this is serious. I'll be keeping my eye on you. Now that Freya's given you the travel rune to Helheim, it should be unlocked on the table. Helheim. And it's done. We really are doing this. Watching your back. Let me take this moment to tell you that what you are about to do is absolutely insane. Not even Odin can survive this cold. So, I hope those blades work. 